Thanks for checking out our channel. Stick around for a special message. All right, uh, so your nickname is going to be Outrageous Orange. Outrageous Orange. And you've had trouble with this toenail for how long, my friend? Uh, a couple of three years. Yeah, it looks like you've been digging at it. It's ingrown. It hurts. Yes, sir. So you have onychomycosis, which is a nail infection with fungus, but you also have onychogryphosis, which means that you have a thickened... Whoa, 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 where are you going? Sorry, sorry. Okay, so uh, you have requested that we remove the nail, which I, I don't see any reason why we can't, so we're going to do that for you, okay? 10-4. And you're okay if we video your procedure for all our friends on YouTube? Yes. Actually, you, re you requested it, right? <laughs> yes, sir. My daughters <laughs> love watching our oh. stuff. Oh, cool. cool. We're rolling again. We've got outrageous orange. He's, uh, Mr. Orange is making fun of the fact that Mrs. Orange was asking a lot of questions, and <laughs> we silenced her. The doc cured her. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, we're gonna make a little tourniquet here for you, okay? Yes, sir. And uh, the reason we're doing that is we're hoping that your toe will dry up and fall off during the procedure. <laughs> now we're doing that so that we can keep the anesthesia local, right? <clears throat> Works better if it stays right here. You know, I used to do this all the time in the Navy. Oh, really? Yeah? Yes, sir. I was a corpsman. Oh, no kidding. Yes, sir. How long were you in the Navy? Uh, eight years. Really? Nice. You had to leave, huh? Had to go. Don't ask, don't tell? Uh, well, <laughs> the thing is, yes. is, we got drunk. We got drunk. And, and loose lips sink ships. Loose yeah. lips sink ships. Well, all right. Well, we're glad to have you, and we appreciate your service. Outrageous Orange, step one. You know what step one is since you've seen this before? Yes, sir. Oh. What you need? I just need alcohol swab, please, ma'am. So we'll do it in two steps. We'll do a real small injection first, and then we'll do a... Uh, a little deeper injection, okay? Mm -hmm. And you got Mrs. Orange holding your knee. I think, <laughs> I think I'm being videoed. That's okay. Just the foot. Just the foot. That's fine. just the and star. The lovely hands. Oh, you're so sweet. Well, thank you so much. You can stay. Absolutely. Send him back to San Antonio. <laughs> okay. Is it true you came all the way from San Antonio? Yeah. Well, we, we're living in San Antonio, but I work the oil field, and I was in oh. Odessa. That's right. There we go. A little stick. Here it comes. What's he going to feel, Gummy Jane? Stick sting and a burn. Yeah. You feeling it, buddy? Oh, no. Not no more. Good. Tough got none there first. Let's get the other side right there. So he's also got a bad case of tinea pedis, which means that you have uh, fungus on the foot, too. And we checked Mrs. Orange, and guess what? They're sharing fungus. Well, you know what they say, uh, marriage that shares fungus stays together. That's, that, they don't say that anywhere. <laughs> oh, I read that in a ship wall. So. Okay, second injection. Are you ready? Yes, sir. All right, here it goes. He's looking like it's not even phasing him. Yeah, he's a tough guy. He is. He's this. tough. And you used to take these out for folks when you were on the ship? Or submarine? Or uh, no. Are you allowed to say? Well, I can. That's not. I just won't drop names. But the coolest thing I did is I removed somebody's toenail, and then the patient went in the parking lot and showed his wife how nice his toe was. <laughs> oh man! And kicked a rim. Oh! And that happened on a Thursday, so he came back because we were closer with the weekend on Monday, and his toe was swollen. He broke his toe. He broke his toe. Oh, that's <laughs> awful. All right, so we have to give this a few minutes to work, okay? Yes. Sir. All right, and then we'll be back with you. Oh, yeah, let's relight like this thing. He's ah! he's uh. Yeah. He's a tough one. He's a tough guy. He wants to get this done, and I want to do it. I don't want to hurt anybody. He really wants it. But he really wants this nail gone. Oh. So before we start, we need to test the tip of his toe again, because I wouldn't want mm. him to feel any pain. Now, you might feel some pressure, okay? But you shouldn't feel sharp pain. Do you understand the difference? Yes, sir. Okay. Are, Are you, you watching? Pain? Oh, I'm being videoed. I'm being videoed by Mama, too. Mrs. Orange, I meant to say. <laughs> are you finding, are you okay? Because you look like you're doing all right. You haven't screamed or anything? No. That's good. You're not going to? No, sir. All right. I may scream for him. You might scream for him. That might be a good idea. So we're using the nail lifter now to separate the nail from the nail bed. We want to be careful because there's so much fungus in here. We don't want that fungus to, we don't want to crack the nail. Basically, we want to break the nail. We want to get it out in one piece. And, and when the, uh, you have fungus involvement in the nail like this, what can happen is 
is it weakens the nail. So we'll actually come in from over here and we'll just kind of gently work on this. You woke up once before during procedure. I'm about to go buy him some tequila. I'm serious. Mm. How about some mezcal? Does that sound good, buddy? Yeah, eat the worm. I feel bad for every sailor that I ever did this to. Yeah. Do you? Yeah. That is in there really deep. Wow. You just have extremely oh large toenail. Gosh. Look at all that infection underneath. You see that? Mm-hmm. See all that? Well. I have some good news for you. You made it. Talk to me, Doc. The nail is out. The other good news is, oh is the medicine I'm going to give you to prevent this nail fungus from coming back is also the same, will also work for your tinea pedis, Yay. which is the uh, fungal infection on your feet. You've got this generalized moccasin-like uh, tinea pedis. So, all right, so I wrote you a prescription. Uh, here's the trick. Don't let this get wet. Have you heard that before on any of our other videos? No, sir. All right, so the thing you want to do is don't let this get wet for three days. Uh, let's get him wrapped up, and I'll give you something for pain, okay? Yes, sir. All right, so you guys need to work on the bathroom floor, all right, the shower floor. Make sure that you scrub with bleach uh, about once a week for a few weeks because you've got that, that porous kind of mm -hmm. stone, right? Because mm -hmm. you don't want any fungus to get, you know, to still survive down in there because you can end up getting the, the fungus back on your feet. So work on that. Okay, Gummy Jane, he's all yours. Bye, guys. So hey, my name is Melissa and I've been taking Meta7 for about three months now. Um, I'm really loving this product. Uh, it's definitely helped me steer off caffeine and energy drinks. It's definitely giving me that little boost so I can go ahead and start my day. My goal is to keep, keep continuing to take this product. Uh, so hopefully we'll see in the next three more months how it goes, but definitely recommend it. You can definitely go on Amazon and look it up and check it out, it's great. Order yours today. There's an Amazon link in the description below. Hi, my name's Liam, and I just want to do a review for uh, Coco Skin Plus. I've been on it for about two and a half months now. Um, I do recommend it. It has given me, I don't know if you want to zoom in, my nails have definitely gotten stronger, um, and my hair. I did bleach my hair uh, last year. Um, don't ever bleach your hair. It will kill your hair and finally my hair is actually looking normal thanks to this actually and um, it's a 90 day supply uh, it took about I wasn't seeing anything really until a month a month and a half in to really notice uh, changes but it's been doing great I love it